new year. I got my st stock going for my black eyed peas. I have smoked turkey wings in there. And I found a ham bone that I saved from Christmas. So this will need to cook down for a couple of hours. So I got my beans over here soaking. I'll rinse those off. I started soaking those. I don't know where the bubbles are. But they've been soaking overnight. So as this cooks down several hours, I will look at that. Run into 2022, honey. Hey y'all, how you doing? Happy January 1st. Don't worry about my face. I just came back from the track. Yes, I'm trying to trying to build up that habit, different mindset, new mindset, get it together, get my life together, child. So, I guess the one thing I can control is what I choose to put in my body and what I do to my body. But let me tell you something. I'm going to use up what I have first. Okay, you know what I mean? No need for waste. <laughs> so anyway, I don't want to start acting crazy because you know how I do. That's never going to change. I'm always going to be me. I'm going to be me. But do you do me? No, it's the same. You're just crazy. But that's all right. Listen, 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 listen. You know, I'm back in this closet, y'all. I was trying not to make this video. Then again, I don't remember if I did. But if I did, just pretend like you're hearing it for the first time because I don't remember. You know, that sometimes that happens when you get a little older. <laughs> But anyway, I really don't remember. I don't think I did. Maybe I did. I don't know. Anyway, listen, 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 listen. Why? I didn't want to make this video. I really, really did not. Okay? And honestly, I no longer know what to do. I don't know. Some of you may know, for my new subscribers that are non-existent. <laughs> but from all my five subscribers, that's about to be five million. <laughs> For those who don't know, you know, if you just happen to come on my channel just because, but don't click off. Now, you can do do, it, do what's going to make you happy for 2022. Do you, boo. New year, new me. Okay? So, remember my daughter, Barbie, and I told you about the blessing it was for her to get the car after she had a car accident, blah, blah, blah. But, baby, it seems like it's turning into a nightmare. It's like some things that are too good to be true, it probably is. So with that said, she got the car, great. Drove her to college, dropped her off, great. No problems with the car. Knock on wood, child. Knock, 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 knock on wood. No problems with the car. Ooh, let me see. Look at my head. My... <laughs> hey, y'all, how y'all doing? <laughs> Right. Mm, that's the do rag and look. Okay, stay focused, y'all. Stay focused. I did take medication today, <laughs> but you know, sometimes it works and sometimes it. Okay, let's go. okay. She got the car, and like I said before, sometimes when something is too good to be true, it probably is. I, I know. I, I'm, I said it twice, so don't come for me. Nah, no, nobody be coming for me. <laughs> so anyway. Bobby was driving in Arkansas. She got pulled over. We knew it was going to be inevitable. But let me backtrack a little bit. Homegirl was hit up for expired license, expired plate, no registration, no inspection, no nothing. You can't see a license plate, no nothing. Zero. Nothing. Okay, the expired driver's license, that was on her. But she didn't know when she turned 18, she had to get a new license, okay? That was our ignorance. We didn't know. So now we learn something new when Cindy turns 18, which is right around the corner. Baby, go down and get you a new driver's license, okay? We, lesson learned. Lesson learned. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Is that how it goes? Yeah, because that's shame on me. Shame on you the first time because you knew. Anyway, let so, we have been without an inspection. We have been without a registration. We have been without 
a license plate. Nothing. Nada. We have called. I have played the nice guy. I have had my car guy, who's phenomenal, look into it. The car is not even registered in the state of Texas. Now, when you get a car, the car needs to be registered. I can't do that. Whoever has the title needs to do that. And when you get a car, that's part of your process of your paperwork. Registration, inspection, license plate, at a minimum. Okay, so baby, nothing. I've called, I've texted, I've pleaded, Bobby pleaded. The, we need this, we need this. It was like, she's gonna get pulled over, she's gonna have tickets, blah, blah, blah. Baby, Bobby called me. As soon as she heard my voice, poor baby started crying. The cops pulled her over. I was like, girl, this is a, this is nothing. And I say, remember, you are the daughter of a warrior, honey. We've been through so much more. I've been through so much more. You are okay. Let me tell you, this cop pulled you over. You're still breathing. You're still alive. He didn't throw you on the ground and put you in handcuffs and lock you up. So that's the blessing in itself. And I said, this is okay. This is a life lesson, and we're going to learn from it, and we're going to keep it moving. As soon as we get this situation under wraps, life lesson we got to be more careful who we decide to buy cars from buy things from and we're going to keep going from there and this is going to make you wiser on this topic on this situation you're going to be okay so no tears here because you're a warrior and this is how you build your arsenal of experience and this is an experience that we're going to get through it because we've been through so much so much worse this is nothing honey and I said besides you want to be an attorney this is gonna be your first look true look inside of a courtroom so honey just absorb this experience and learn from it and grow from it okay you are gonna be okay all right mama loves you all right take care bye bye so she has to go to court she once again I know I said this listen again like you hearing it for the first time her driver's license was expired not good you couldn't even see the temporary plate on a car anymore it, it, it was expired it, it disappeared the letters the ink went bye bye everything gone poof and that's what got her pulled over because the officer couldn't see the plate we do have insurance I don't play with that I don't play with that you know it's kicking my butt but we do have insurance and the officer's like well you gotta go to court so he didn't give her a ticket so I don't know when she goes to court she goes to court this month in January I don't know if she can explain that she did um, get her new driver's license we got that uh, we did get the car inspected. We told the car guy we got it inspected. Now we need to get the registration because you can't get the registration without the inspection. And we couldn't get the inspection done in Arkansas because that's not their law. It's not required in Arkansas. So when she came back home, she went the next day and got the inspection. I was like, here's a copy of it. What do you need me to do? I will, I will go do it. I said, I don't want to go into 2022 with this dark cloud over us. I want Bobby to go into 2022 all settled dog off. Oh. Crickets. And I really didn't want to do this video, but honestly, we cannot afford an attorney. My car, my car guy was like, you may need to get an attorney. I can't afford no attorney. Shoot, I, I'm barely trying to stay alive. Even when I blew my nose today, my nose started bleeding. I'm like, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I can't afford to lose no more blood. <laughs> slow down, partner, slow down. Slow down, bro. Uh-uh, even when they was taking the blood from my arm, you know, to run the test, I'm like, miss, I don't got much left. How much, how many more tubes you need, miss? <laughs> Look, I'm on E, honey. I'm just like, this nose keep bleeding. I might be down to negative zero. That did. So I, got, I did get a little, I don't know why I started. Maybe I blew it too hard. I don't know. But I haven't had a nose bleed in a while. I don't need no more blood loss. Okay? So, as I go back, as I got off track, but you know me. And honestly, I don't know what to do. Filing a complaint will not fix the, fix the problem. We did look them up, eventually look them up later, and we did find that there were several complaints filed against him. So he did eventually, he said he mailed and overnighted another temporary plate, but no. So he emailed her a temporary plate on a piece of paper. So she got to print that on a piece of paper. You can't put that on the back of your car and we don't have the clear plastic sleeve. So she put it in the window and her tent is pretty dark but at least and I don't even know when that expires I'll have to text her and ask her when that expires I've texted the guy 
um, about three times while I've been on break and say, you know, I'll run down, I'll take care of the stuff. You need me to go down and do the registration. I know, you know, running a business can be pretty challenging and time consuming. I could be a runner because I really want to start the new year off 2022 with this all settled and behind us. No response. No response. So what's going to happen once again the temporary tags are about to expire again and then still no license plate still no registration it's still not registered in the state of texas the car is registered or the last known place was florida um as far as i know the guy moved here to texas from florida so i don't know and then ironically bobby's best friend is dealing with the same exact thing I believe her place expired December 18th. Guy won't call back. He won't do anything. Nothing. So I don't I don't know what this is. I don't know what to do to fix it. Once again, I can't afford an attorney and file a complaint. What's that going to do? It's not going to miraculously solve the problem. It's not. It's like, you know, let me get everything I need to get before I go down that route. So I've been trying to be the nice guy and be, you know, let me help you that's not even working and I'm quite sure being irate is not going to work either what does it say you can catch more bees what honey then I don't know what to do do you have any suggestions for us at this point point? and I believe you can only get two temporary tags so I don't I don't know I'm thankful he eventually emailed that even though he said he was going to overnight it. That never happened. So I don't know. And the guy is so nice. He's, he's really nice. It's just, I don't know what the problem. Why, why do people go into business and do this? I, I just don't understand. Just like I don't understand how a man could walk away from his kids. I don't understand it. If you got a problem. See, now I'm going off topic now. But I'm going to save that for another video. <laughs> so, whew, I don't know, guys. Um, if you have any suggestions or anything that we can do to get this situation expedited and put behind us, leave it in the comment section below. But the girl can't keep getting pulled over. And I wish I could go to court with her. So, but I'm like, you better tell them the truth. You've been trying. It's like, you know, some of these dealers, they prey on people. I, I, I just don't understand. Whoa, whoa. I mean, that's like setting yourself up for a bad reputation, which we should have, we should have done our due diligence first. And we kind of messed up on that one. But like I said, if something is too good to be true, it probably is. Although we got the car, he didn't have to do that. But now look at us. We're still in a jacked up situation. So give this video a thumbs up or not. 2022 do what you gonna do honey stick to your goals stick to you stick to what's gonna make you happy stick to it don't let up don't let up so i'm gonna try this workout thing to be consistent for 30 straight days so day one <laughs> i gotta get back on my grind i fell off <laughs> you know sometimes when you start you know do relationship and stuff you <laughs> you be falling off you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying about nah, 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 nah. i gotta get back on uh for nobody but for myself and for my health stick around a little longer you know what i'm saying